First unit is nutrition. Second is refrigeration. Third is transformation. Fourth one is excretion. So we are discussing about excretion topic. So what are the excretion organs in human beings? What are the organs in what are the excretion organs in human beings? Lungs. Excretion organs. Yesterday we discussed what? Kidney. Say it again. Kidney. Kidneys are excretory organs. Yesterday we discussed. Kidneys are excretory organs. Kidneys are excretory organs in human beings. How many kidneys are there? Two. Two kidneys. Yesterday we discussed. And you are not giving answer. Right? What are the chief excretory organs in human beings? Come on, tell me. Kidneys. Kidneys. What are the chief Excretory organs in human beings? Kidneys. Say it again. Kidneys. Kidneys are the excretory organs. How many kidneys are present? Two. What is the shape of kidney? Pinnacle. Color? Pinnacle. Length? Pinnacle. And width? Pinnacle. And thickness? Pinnacle. That's what you discussed. So kidneys are excretory organs. Excretory organs. And now I am telling you other. Pathways of excretion. So kidneys are removing waste material from the blood. Okay. And now I am telling you, other organs are also present in our body. They are also helpful in removal of waste. They are also helpful in removal of waste from the blood, from the body. So they are accessory excretory organ. They are also called. They are also called as accessory excretory organ. And now I am telling you, what are they? So here you see uh, four headings are there. First one, lungs. lungs. Next, skin. 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 Third, liver. Fourth one is large intestine. So these are called other accessory excretory organ, other than kidney. Lungs. Lungs are mainly useful for what purpose? Respiration. In addition to that, how many lungs are present? Two lungs are present. Two lungs are present. And two lungs are useful for respiration, breathing. In addition to that, lungs also helpful in removal of carbon dioxide and water. Suppose if you keep your what mirror in front of your nose, you observe what presents a water film, a thin film of water is formed on the mirror, and that means in addition to carbon dioxide, and they also helpful in removal of keep it stop. Go there. So they also help in removal of waste like carbon dioxide and water. So lungs are useful to remove what carbon dioxide and also water. water. So in this way, lungs also help in that performing pure function, breathing. In addition to that, they also remove what carbon dioxide and water. water. Lungs are remove what carbon dioxide and water. water, and they are helpful for breathing. So that is called that is the reason they are called as necessary excretory organs. They are performing breathing. In addition, they also remove what carbon dioxide and water. And now I am telling you skin. So this is skin. And skin is providing what protection to our body. And skin consists of large number of what sweat glands. Sweat glands. And these sweat glands are useful to remove the what water excess of water and salt from the body. Sweat glands are Richly supplied with blood vessels. Blood vessels are present here, and they blood vessels they and these sweat glands are present in the in the sweat gland around the sweat gland. Blood vessels are present, and these sweat glands remove the waste materials, excess of water, and also what salt. So in addition to that, providing protection, they also remove what excess of water and also salt. So that is the reason skin is called. Accessory excretory organ. Again, you see in the skin, sebaceous glands are present. Sebaceous glands are present. Oil glands are present. And these sebaceous glands are useful to remove what sebum. And sebum consists of sebum, waxes, sterol, and hydrocarbon. And four are there. First one, sterol. Next, waxes, waxes, hydrocarbon, and fatty acids. To open your textbook and see, there you see sebaceous glands are useful to produce sebum, oil, and sebum consists of waxes, sera, hydrocarbons, and fatty acids. And these are waste, and these are waste which are elevated to skin. Okay, 
And now I'm telling you liver. The liver is the largest gland in the body. The main function of liver is, here you see, uh, production of bilirubin, bile salts. And bile salts that is of bilirubin and bilirubin and urochrome. And these salts are produced by the destruction of old RBC cell. Lifespan of RBC cell is 1 to 3 days. After 1 to 3 days, uh, RBC cells are destroyed. And later, bile salts are produced. Bile pigments are produced. Produce. They are bilirubin, bilirubin and urochrome. Bilirubin, bilirubin and urochrome. And liver is also involved in urea formation. Ammonia form, urea formation, it is done. Liver is also involved in what? Urea formation, then you see in textbook, liver, last line. Last, liver last. Liver is also useful formation of what? Urea. 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 Online. Liver Online. is also useful for the formation of urea. Urochrome is produced. And uh, these the, are the waste products which are produced from the liver. Liver is useful for the production of bile salt. Bile salt from this are bile urbane, bile burden, and urochrome. And other waste products also produced or released are secreted from the liver. So here liver is also acts as a accessory exchange organ. And now I am telling you large intestine. So large intestine, you know what is intestine? Almondic color study from some mouth. Next step, buckle cavity. Next step, pharynx. Next step, pharynx. No, no, pharynx. Larynx is a respiratory system. Next step, esophagus. Next step, stomach. Next step, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. These are the parts of almondic color. Large intestine. Large intestine is useful for elimination of some elements like they are. Calcium, next, magnesium, and iron. Okay? Then you see calcium and magnesium and iron. So these are the waste products which are eliminated from the epithelial cells of the column. Colon. Colon and so called as large intestine. So these waste are eliminated from the large intestine. And finally, I am telling you, tears also we are producing when you are not when you are not feeling well. And we are, when you are in angry, and the term tears are produced. And tears also can be of a little amount of nitrogenous waste material. Okay. And today I told you what accessory exit organ. So, what are the accessory exit organ? Urine, lungs, liver, lungs, skin, liver, and These are called accessory exit organ. Now I am telling you. Now I am asking few percent. Neha, what are the you please stand up? What are the chief exit organs in your body? Kidney. Say bigger. Kidney. Kidney. Sit down. And what are the both of you please come? What are the other organ which are called accessory exit organ which are helpful in removal of waste? Lungs. Lungs. Skin. Skin. Liver. Liver. Lungs. 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 Lungs are helping in what waste? Carbon dioxide and water. And skin is eliminating what? Excess of water and sweat. And liver is eliminating what? Bioprint, bioprint and urochrome. And large intestine is eliminating what? Calcium, magnesium and iron. So that is the reason that these organs are called as accessory exit organ. In addition to that, they have come with their own function. I told you, lungs are useful for what? Breathing. In addition to that, they also have put in removal of carbon dioxide and water. Removal of carbon dioxide and water. So, today I told you what? What? Other pathways Other pathways of excretion. Other pathways of excretion are accessory exit organs. Come on, tell me. Accessory exit organs. Read. 